how to draw trend lines effectively in trading view that's what we are going to discuss today in the trading view trick series from market secrets before we get started i'd like to mention that we at market secrets have recently launched algo traders program atp if you are someone who is interested in learning end to end algo trading then check out our atp program i'll leave the link to it in the description section of this video and with that note let's jump into today's session on trend line drawing okay so first uh, let's uh, find out uh, where the trend line drawing tool is okay so uh, it should be right here so if you look at here right uh, there's a trend line tool i'm adding it uh, as by favorite okay so any tool that uh, you are using frequently you can just add it uh, to your favorites so now i'm selecting this and i'm uh, you know uh, putting it here and i'm drawing my trend line okay so two clicks and you're done now let's go to the settings okay so trend line is uh, uh, something that uh, is not supposed to be visible in other time zones other than the one where you're drawing okay so if it is a uh, you know uh, support or resistance zones and all right uh, those can be visible uh, you know in the lower time frames okay but uh, for trend line it should be visible only in the time frame in which uh, you're drawing it so this is a weekly uh, time frame so i'm selecting only weekly uh, as by visibility okay so i'm selecting uh, okay here so color you can actually change it and um, you know, I know, uh, black looks better yeah so uh, now you can uh, create a template as well okay save it as a template okay weekly trend line okay so if you do this uh, what happens now is like this uh, um, you know um, trend line will be visible only in the weekly chart okay this won't uh, affect your daily chart if you want to draw a trend line in a daily chart now right what you can do is like you can uh, click here and draw the smooth trend line okay now if you want to extend it also yeah, extend it now um, you know here you can um, create another template daily trend line okay so this will be visible only in the daily time frame okay so i'm removing it uh, weekly from the visibility so now if i um, you know uh, go back and you know i'm just uh, for the sake of doing it i'm doing it uh, just to show you you some example so another trend line i'm drawing here so this by by default will take the weekly time, sorry daily time frame uh, template going back to weekly so only whatever we have drawn that's visible here okay so I'm go scrolling back and here there is another zone i'm drawing okay so yeah this is actually broken but still right uh, just for example i'm drawing but uh, whenever you draw in a different time frame you can select uh, the, the other time frames or uh, uh, the correct time frame setting okay so if you do this right uh, your charts will look actually good it won't look cluttered otherwise right if you uh, not using these templates while drawing the trend line slide uh, you know all these settings will be applicable let's see to the lower time frame and see how messy it will look like you know if you don't uh, use the right setting okay so going to learn. see it uh, already started looking ugly um you know uh, so when it comes to uh, trend lines right uh, it's uh, always uh, you know good to use the template uh, while drawing the trend line so that you know uh, you draw it the right way okay so with this we are uh, closing today's session if you have any queries let me know in the comment section also hit uh, like share and subscribe buttons if you find this video useful thank you